afternoon, Barstow. I hope you guys have all had a good day after um, a long weekend. I'm Amelia. Hey, Aaron, what are you doing? Oh, you know, I'm just getting hyped for the pink out volleyball game. It's happening tonight at 6. Well, you look super hyped for the game, and I think the rest of us could use a little bit more of that hype. So Camille made a piece about the girls' pink out volleyball game. Let's roll it. Uh, hi, my name is Coach Foster, and I'm the varsity volleyball coach. This is actually my fifth year being the volleyball coach here at Barstow. So Pink Out started back when I was in high school here at Barstow and it was a way for us to raise awareness and raise money for um, Susan G. Komen, the Breast Cancer Foundation. And it's just a really great way. We have all the middle schoolers come out and the high schoolers come out and it's a really great way to support a cause and also bring the community together. The volleyball teams, both teams, the home and the away team, actually wear pink jerseys that we get made from the athletic department and then all the fans wear pink and then every year we also make a pink out shirt that the bookstore and the online bookstore sell and so this year it says power in pink and one of the varsity volleyball girls brooke dryden actually designed the shirt for everyone to wear this year uh, make sure you guys come out to the game it's just going to be a really fun night can't wait to see you guys there hi i'm Haley greenwood and i am the varsity volleyball setter the season is going really well. We're currently undefeated in conference and district, and it's looking really good for state. It's my first year of being in Pink Out. Um, my sister has been on the varsity team for, I think, two years now. And so when I was in middle school, I always looked forward to playing at the Dig Pink game. Like I've been so excited for it for like four years. So I'm really, really happy that it's finally happening. Be sure to come out to the Dig Pink game. It's super fun, should be a great game. Um, and if you're a middle schooler, then you can get free pizza if you wear pink or the dick pink shirt. Good luck to the volleyball team at the pink out game. Also, BTVN will be live streaming the game. The girls volleyball team is coming into the game from a great season so far. And in fact, they won on Thursday against Van Horn to win the conference. They are also undefeated in their conference. Congratulations to the cross country team on their success at the Maranatha meet last week. Luke Whitfield plays fifth and Isabella Welty plays ninth. In tennis news, the girls' JV tennis season ended. Here's a piece made by Isabella about the JV season. Hi, I'm Mr. Downs. I'm one of the tennis coaches here at Barstow. I'm the JV coach, and then uh, Tom O'Brien is the varsity coach. And there's been some successes on both ends and some we wish we could do better yet, and so we just aren't satisfied, and we're just going to keep working hard. Hi, I'm Ayushi, and I'm one of the captains for the girls' tennis team, and we are really looking forward to this season. We've already started off with a really strong start. I'm Afra and I'm on the JV tennis team and our season went really well. Um, a lot of the players on our team were newbies and they definitely improved really quickly. And um, a lot of the matches we had in the past were really good. We played really, really well. Maybe if we didn't win all of them, we still did really well. Um, when we played against Casey Christian, we won most of our matches and I think that was really, it was really nice to have that feeling after losing a lot. <laughs> Overall, we had a really good season, and I want to thank Sam's mom for getting us snacks every single day um, because that really helped us play. In individual districts, Serena Biria got first place, and Ayishi Sethi got third place. In doubles, Atra Biria and Phoebe Martin got first place, and Mary Colombo and Leah Adams got second place. How did districts go, and how did you guys do? So I think it went really well. We all actually placed, which is the first time I think that's ever happened. They all qualified for state, and how do you guys feel about that? I'm really excited. Me too. <laughs> you should follow us at Barstow underscore tennis yeah. to keep updated with the team. We have fun. <laughs> Congrats to the girls' tennis team. The tennis team district matches are taking place tonight and tomorrow night at Barstow. With tennis and other sports, tonight's going to be a packed night for home games. Also taking place is the Matt Gannon Cross Country Invitational at 4 and the Pink Out Volleyball game at 6. Lastly, the boys' soccer team has a home game at, against Heritage Christian at 7. 
Make sure to go out and support all of our teams. To end our show, we wanted to remind you that October is Sudden Cardiac Arrest Awareness Month. This month, we will be remembering Mr. Gannon, the late middle school teacher and cross-country coach who passed away from this condition in 2019. Today's cross-country meet is named in Mr. Gannon's honor, and his mother will be at the meet providing information about sudden cardiac arrest. Thanks, Barstow, and we hope to see you there.